Keine Ahnung. So, usually when you land in Batanas on a plane, you come out and you gotta get a tourist fee for the island. It's like 350 pesos and it allows you to go around and tour. Um, I landed on a cargo ship, so I didn't even know it existed. So I actually came out to the airport right now. I'm gonna go buy that and uh, pay my fee so I can just go tour a tour. It's so funny, I didn't even know. Oh no, it's locked. Well, that's actually quite funny. So, turns out uh, they, only, they only collect the tourism fees uh, when the airlines land because that's how all tourists come here. So, there's nobody at the desk right now, so I can't actually pay my fee. So, I'll just come back later tomorrow and pay it. But uh, that's what happens when you take a cargo ship to Batanas. I can't pay my environment fee. We got a motor shop. Fixing a king motor with scooter. Igal, as as a gato. Ayos, survive for more bike. That's cool, Mug Visaya. It's a local working here, Visaya. Okay, I'm on the move this morning. Let's see, uh, see what we're up to. Okay, so good morning. Uh, today, it's a good day. Uh, Radio K finished filming. They've left, so they're gonna air their uh, story tomorrow. But what I was up to this morning is fixing up Cindy again. I gave her an oil change. The local shop. Yeah. Nice one. Hiya. How are you doing, Cindy? Okay, man. Nice one. Nice. Thank you, Brad. Bye. Lama. Nice one. That was it. Just Lama Hus. Hiya. That's your welcome. Just Lama Hus means you're welcome, right? I got it. And I practiced, I said, Mani Bira. Mani Bira means how much. There's 300 pesos I gave Cindy. And oil change. Welcome to Basco. So this is the municipality we're staying in. It's the main one by the port. And today we're just going to tour tour, or they say bidi bidi, which is come toast, or pashal pashal. So let's do it. This is incredibly beautiful. This is the oh, freaking knee every time. So clumsy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know what? I'm keeping that in. This is incredibly beautiful. And you gotta watch your legs when you're walking around because there's a lot of rocks. As you can see, there's stones everywhere. Anyways, this is Mahatau. And uh, it is the first municipality just south of Basco. Basco is the main municipality. We arrive on the port in Batanas. There's this really beautiful little fishing cove with a lighthouse on the side there that I think is being built or it's kind of old. And then this kind of cool building that connects it to these rocky cliffs. So I'm just going to chill. Look at the water too. It's so clean.
just sometimes you gotta have speed going up these hills. Remember this. If you're gonna use this scooter in the future here, that's a hint for what's to come. Make sure uh, you take care of her on the hill. Taiji Lighthouse. It was built in 2000. It overlooks the Pacific Ocean. Absolutely beautiful. It's here in Mahatao Batanas. Stunning views. So we stopped at this local canteen on the road and just across as well, there's actually the port that's going to take us to Sabtung tomorrow. We're going to come here tomorrow. Check it out. Nice port. So relaxed here, can you tell? Uh, we talked to the drivers. It's 6 a.m. We're going to town by here and then we're going to go to Sabtung, which is the island across the way for a day trip. So it's time to eat though. I'm hungry. I still can't believe you cheer, bro. Look, and they have fancy kabagas. What, you have kebagun? Do you have, have batil patong? No. Yeah, the you do? Can you make it? Yes. Really? Yeah. Are you serious? <laughs> Myron is a legend. This is like, I mean, I, of course I want to eat some local uh, food here, but I mean, how could you say no to two gee girl pants it and deliciousness and chicharaba? You're a legend, Myron. Uh, yes, I'm excited. <laughs> you even sang. Um, Myron, you've done it. That's Pensa Batio Patong, isn't it? Oh my gosh. That is so That's good. It? Yes, it's like a Because the egg's on top. And then the meat. You've never had it? No, I never. Oh man, you are lucky. You met somebody from Tugigoro. <laughs> In Batang. This is why everybody needs a friend from Tugigoro. Right there. Pensa Batio Patong in Batanas. Myron's is the best. This guy here, Myron, I'm hunting him down. From Tugigoro, 10 years, the best. If you want to experience Tugigoro, just come to Myron's canteen and he's good vibes. And I'm sweating because the food is so good. We're gonna have Kapatsa Kabaga. We're eating everything in this canteen, so thank you, Myron. And even has the best, Merienda Sagi. You gotta love the, the tricycles here, they're so cool now. Uh, we're going up to a place called Tukoi Church, Tukoi I believe, and it looks super beautiful. It's like a stone, yeah, wow, stunning.
So this is the Mount Carmel Chapel here uh, in Sitio Tuca in, in Batanas and it is beautiful. It's a simple stone chapel surrounded with beautiful grassy fields and epic views. Uh, what a lot of people don't realize though is this is actually heavily damaged by Super Typhoon Ferdy back in 2016. So a lot of people come here and visit this. It's heavily photographed and very beautiful. But make sure too to throw out a simple donation so they can restore this because you can't, they can't. There's only about 35 families who live here. So a simple thing you can do. Toss 20 pieces in the box, then take your beautiful photos and enjoy the area. That is a beautiful building. <laughs> so you can see, uh, it is definitely a super popular site, eh? But uh, I'll be blunt and saying, there was probably about 50 people just visited when we were here. How many of them put a donation in the box? Zero. So, I mean, if you have the money to come to Vitanis and you want to visit some of the beautiful sites, it's nice to support them as well. And I just want to be a bit blunt about that because I was shocked that absolutely nobody there was throwing in donations. So, beautiful chapel, but maybe let's help rebuild it too with just a simple donation. It's like uh, buying a bottle of water. <laughs> 